super exciting video today. I'm going to be showing you a prom get ready with me. I'm so excited to start off like my prom kind of series and just kind of show you guys what I'm wearing to prom. In this video, I do my makeup, hair, and I show you my prom dress. And I'm so, so excited. It's probably the next in two months, but I just wanted to get these videos out early and kind of encourage you guys to go prom shopping. Now, why am I doing this hand motions? Because, I mean, why would you not? A lot of you guys are asking what, where like, I'm getting my dresses here, but so I was like, why not make this video? And if you know me, you know I'm obsessed with Nordstrom. I mean, literally, I've been shopping in Nordstrom since I think I was like 12. It's in my favorite store. You could live there. Honestly, all my, like 99% of my bags, because they have all the designer brand shoes and clothes and makeup are from Nordstrom. Some people are like, where are you getting your dress? I was like, girl, this, this, is, this is a probability equation. We already know. So my dress is from Nordstrom. They have an amazing selection of prom dresses this year. Holy crap. I'll link down um, a link to like, their dress section and a link to like, an accessories type section. So feel free to check that out with just Nordstrom. But I'll put them down below for you guys because I found a really nice section of dresses and I was looking through them and I was like, holy crap, these are beautiful. So I decided to get my dress now because it's a smart one because I have some holiday money. Ooh, ooh, and I'm sure you guys have holiday money too, so it's perfect time to get your dress. And I like to get mine early so no one has a similar one. And yeah, I'm just really, really, really excited to show you guys my dress I'm going to wear. So I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Please give me a thumbs up. It helps out a lot. And subscribe for more videos. And let's just get into it, shall we? So I'm starting off with adding a little bit of cream contour to my face since during prom take a bunch of photos, we take pictures outside and inside, at least I do. I like to make sure that my face is super defined and like all my features show up in the photos. So by doing this, it kind of puts some shadows where they need to be. And I'm just going to blend that out super carefully into my skin so that there are no harsh lines or edges. And then I'm going to put on some cream um, concealer under my eyes and up on my forehead and nose of like the bridge of my nose where the light normally hit so again that like reflex and also defines your face a little more um, I think this is really nice to do on prom it's a little bit more makeup but it's really worth it and then I'm gonna set my face with some powder because you know when we dance I want my makeup to stay in place and not move and not like fly away from me because you know I like my makeup and then I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows with a gel also so that my eyebrows will be on fleek and you guys can comment on my Instagram mark my words comment on my Instagram on prom and let me know if my eyebrows are on fleek because I assure you girl that they will be Okay, okay, deal, do we have a deal? I think we have a deal. And then I'm gonna add some bronzer because um, in photos I end up looking a little bit washed out, especially if you're on the paler side, you can really easily look white casted. So by adding bronzer in those same exact areas, it really helps a lot. And I'm putting on a little heavier than normal, but again, it's prom, I can do what I want, okay? And then I'm going to prime my eyes so that my eyeshadow also stays in place. You know, makeup's trying to run away from me, so I just have to like put it back in place. And then I'm going to start off by putting this taupey brown in my crease and then I'm going to start layering some shadows as you can tell I'm going to put a darker brown and then a black in the crease just to get like a you know gradient ombre effect it looks really nicely transitioned we like it <laughs> Then I'm going to start adding a black color in the crease again just to deepen up my eyes and make them look kind of like bigger and brighter and in photos it really like makes them look a lot bigger if you put in a black in like kind of a V shape. I'm trying to do that softly again so it's not really harsh I'm not just like throwing on some black in there. I'm really blending it out again kind of a V shape to lift my eyes which I really really like. Then I'm going to put some under the eyes again to smoke it out. It might get a little bit messy, but it is a-okay. We were going to clean that up with some concealer. I'm just going to get rid of that, you know, make it clean. And then I'm going to apply some false lashes. Bam, they're already on. And line my lips with a darker nude color. And then I'm going to use a nude lip gloss just so that my lips have like some contrast. Like the lip liner is darker so that it makes them look more plump. Again, for the photos, girl. <music> And for my hair, I just curled it and I have a whole entire tutorial on how I curl my hair, so just be sure to click on the screen if you want to find out how I got these curls, girl. Mm -hmm. 